Hello, beginning of uh, beginning of winter. Got my hat on. It's not winter. Just cold mm. and wet. <laughs> so Ash and I are doing some videos for you guys. Um, we're looking at projects that we've done, explaining what we did, uh, what mistakes we made, how things went well, and we're outside of Ellsworth. Yeah. Uh, we did this as a buy to sell project, just the business itself, didn't we? It was one of the first ones that the business did, I think, actually. Sorry. Yeah, on its own. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'd done some JVs with folks before, but I hadn't actually done a, we hadn't done one solo yeah. with the, that the business funded. Mm -hmm. So this one we bought for 103. 103, and it was bought before auction. Pre auction. Um, it was bought from a really lovely lady actually whose yeah. mum had gone into a home yeah. and um, funds were a wee bit tight at the time so they were just looking to kind of secure some fees so that they could pay for the, the care home and stuff like that. So I actually met her quite yeah. a few times and she was lovely and organised, she was mm -hmm. ever such a nice woman and she was kind of really grateful we'd bought it and pre because she was so nervous selling it mm -hmm. in an auction she just wanted to yeah. know how much mum's care fees were. Mm -hmm. So um, I got some photos actually which I can uh, f flash up to the camera let's hope. So this was pre, it was just an older person's house. Um, she was, she was a, a rather Rather magnificent gardener. Um, I thought I was really impressed with her garden. And let's just show you pre. There you go, and there you go. Um, so you know, it was, it was tired uh, to be polite about it. So what we did, we spent 15 grand on it, and we sold it for 150. Our deal report said 145, but we privately thought it's probably going to be 150. And we actually we got it, didn't we? And we got that within 11 days. Of, oh look, your head's cut. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> we, we got that within 11 days of putting it on the market, and we put it on the market like the first or second week in January. So I think um, we actually put it on over Christmas. Yeah, I think, I think we was. did. I think yeah. we sold it like first week of January. Or something like that. There you go. So 11 days in kind of what you might call the worst time yeah. to get us a sale. Um, we spent 15 grand on it. We renovated it. Uh, we kept the same boiler. Mm -hmm. We kept the same electrics, but we got it certificated. What we did do though was put in an RSJ, which is a steel beam, and we'd opened up the kitchen and the dining room to make yeah. a big kitchen diner, so that you ended up instead of having a living room, a dining room, and a kitchen, and then uh, two double bedrooms and one single bedroom and a bathroom upstairs, we ended up with a nice living room at the front and a really lovely kitchen diner at the back um, we calmed the garden right down even though I loved the garden we didn't feel it was appropriate for people buying a, a house. Bit wild. It was a bit yeah I mean as a gardener I just loved it but mm. it wasn't really a selling garden and then we just decorated beautifully and dressed beautifully and actually we've got quite a few videos about it on our YouTube channel so you might want to look elsewhere for it. Just down there that road um, there's a school so it's great for mm -hmm. families. Um, one of the things that went wrong well, two things. Um, our guys discovered asbestos guttering. Now, there's nothing particularly wrong with that. There was nothing dangerous about it. But we felt that if it was a young family, because, of course, there's a school just down there, and actually we're on the school run at the moment, so there's lots of mums and, like, five-year-olds skipping past. Um, so we just felt that it, we would need to replace that and get it done correctly, and, you know, with certification and evidence as to where it's been disposed. Because what if a mum said, look, it, uh, asbestos guttering's come up in the survey? So it wasn't technically needed, but I think it cost 780 80 pounds yeah. and then the other thing and I'm trying to keep my voice down was the neighborhood's lovely it's really calm really quiet it's gone up it used to be a bit dodgy and then just as I was about to sell a new family moved in next door and it was do, 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 all day long dogs kids everything and I was like oh god this is gonna be a nightmare and really fortunately it didn't seem to prove a problem, but yeah. it could have been a real problem. It sold quite well, I think. It sold really well. So yeah, so this is just a classic pre-auction purchase, bought for 103, 15 grand refurb, sold for 150, on the market for 11 days, um, removed the kitchen, living room, so, uh, sorry, kitchen diner, uh, so you've got a lovely big kitchen diner, um, rather than the kind of 1960s, job done, on to the next. Anything you want to add? No, steady, easy. Yeah. Yeah. Loads, you guys could do it super simple.